In addition to point and paragraph type, text can be applied either horizontally or vertically. Text will be horizontal by default, but it is easy to create and convert type to be vertical, if necessary. Press and hold the type tool on the tools panel to switch from horizontal type to vertical type and vice versa. You can always switch existing type by right plus clicking on the type layer and choosing either horizontal or vertical type. There's even another option if you're interested. You can use the toggle text orientation button on the options bar to quickly switch the orientation of your text. So if we jump back over to our document that we've been working in, I don't want to mess up this fern uh, text, so I'm going to turn the eyeball off so you can't see that layer. And I'm going to create a new type layer. And I don't want it to be horizontal this time. I'm going to press and hold on the type tool and convert it to be vertical text or type. So now when I click and I start typing, T-E-S-T, -E this text is very big because the fern layer has very large text. Um, you can see that the text is typing vertically. I am going to select all, Command A to select all the text with the cursor blinking as Whitney told you in the previous video. And if we change the size to let's say 60, something smaller, you can see that we are typing a column of vertical text. Um, in addition to creating the text that you, the way that you want it, if you create it vertically or horizontally and decide that that's just not right for your needs, you can right click on the layers panel, and so you can right click on the layer, this one is test, and you can convert your text from vertical or horizontal or vice versa. And so I could change my layer to have horizontal text, and you can see it quickly took all the text and made it horizontal. And then that last option is the toggle option. And so you need to select um, your text and highlight it and come up to the options bar at the top of the screen. And in the top left hand corner, there's an option to toggle your text back and forth between vertical and horizontal text. And I'm clicking it, but it doesn't look like anything's happened because I'm zoomed in too far. But if we zoom out and I toggle back and forth, you can see really quickly I could test maybe a couple different layout options for a postcard or a flyer that I'm designing. And I will hand the slideshow back over to Whitney to talk about color. So the text can also uh, be changed by selecting uh, and highlighting a word or phrase and then double clicking the foreground color from the tools panel. So um, changing color is really easy, just like changing from horizontal to vertical text. And um, so I'll show you here. So if we take this word that Jessica just typed, this test word, we can have the text tool selected and select the word. And then you can go over here to the color picker and click here to get your colors options and then you can choose a pleasing color that you'd like for your text. Once you hit OK, um, that, uh, will, that will be applied. You can also, here we go, you can also choose your color by up here on um, the options bar. You can click here and that will also uh, bring up the color pick picker. And one last choice you have is over here on the character panel you can um, click here in the color and also bring up um, the color picker to choose your color. So you can easily change colors in a lot of different ways on the fly.